Hey guys, Alex from Online Tarot is here with another pick a card. Uh, today we will be trying to see what what is your next step to happiness, what you need to do to become happier, to feel happier, to to live a better life. So I've decided to try and do more um, personal readings, personal growth readings for you to focus on your life, your self readings, not to focus on other people too much because well, it doesn't often help as much as we wish it would. I mean, thinking and checking about another person. So, uh, we are focusing on you, on your happiness, on your next to happiness. We will see what uh, the reading will have to tell you. Some guidance, some advice, something to look forward to. So, we have three piles. And as always, please remember, this is a general reading. So, tr please treat it as such. Take it as it resonates and only if it resonates. Uh, for pile number one, we have the aura quartz. For pile number two, we have beautiful, but my camera doesn't show that it's beautiful, labradorite. Labradorite. And for pile number three, we have... Hmm, cultic. It's rather cute. So, choose your pile and I will see you in timestamps. If you cannot see timestamps in the comments, check down the description box down below in the under the video it's always there hey those who chose pound number one let's see what is your next step to happiness huh ooh, 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 ooh. interesting pound number one very strong energy coming from you with this magician you were bro you were born super talented uh, you have more talent than you know. You may have multiple talents, a lot of talents, or very strong one, deep, deep rooted ones. And um, sometimes it's not an easy path. It's not an easy path to bear. But it feels like um, it's it's like a destined path. You chose it. Yeah, with the ten of wands, it's difficult because to stand out rather often means to stand alone, and sometimes feel like you you feel like you are alone, right? But you are like the student of the universe. You are studying new things, this, that, to understand some some deep philosophical questions. You're studying all the time. You're getting new knowledge all the time. And um, you are on, on the right path already. You are on your path with these two aces, ace of cups and ace of pentacles here. Though... It may seem like you are not there yet. It feels like you may be working and working and investing and investing, doing something to get success but um, or to become happy. But maybe it's being postponed or it's being difficult or you feel like maybe you're being punished for something or nothing. I've been getting several, a lot of this lately, like people feel, feeling like the universe is punishing them for something. It's not punishment. It's kind of great path. Paths are always the most difficult ones. So you cannot achieve greatness without uh, persistence, without failure, without, uh, I don't know, falling and getting up, falling and getting up. All the time you can't do this. It's going to come hand in hand. And when you see somebody uh, who has succeeded a lot, who has a lot of success, sometimes people don't see what preceded it. And you are in the preceding stages of your success, but it's kind of, it's kind of destined you are destined to shine. You are destined to be great. And with this Ace of Cups and Ace of Pentacles, okay, your happiness is kind of... get. You're getting it slower than you would like it to get. But you are on the right track. You are on the right path. You're doing... Just keep on going. Keep on going. Just seriously, you are awesome. File number one. File number one. Let's see more. So what's your next step to success? First of all, keep on going. You are on the right track. You are just... Keep on doing what you're already doing. What else you need to know to achieve your... Hmm, you're a dreamer. With this moon, I feel like you're a dreamer. And you've been fighting your inner demons a lot. You've been fighting your inner demons. You, you, mm, how to say, the magician again, you see, you are. And it seems like, okay, okay, okay. The Queen of Pentacles, just give me a second. I know. So, pile number one. 
you are a dreamer but you are a kind of dream dreamers that can make their dreams come true yes it's not easy you have to fight for it you truly have to fight for it and you have to fight yourself for it first there are either in a doubt or in a confusion you are doubting okay i don't have success yet it means maybe i'm not talented maybe i'm not that good maybe i'm not stop it just stop it because it's your inner demon who's kind of eating you up from the inside it's your doubt but it's not true it's not true you are destined for success you need to accept it you need to continue going because the power is in your hands you're, you're very powerful and you are maybe already having some success and you will be having more you you're kind of multiplying your wealth and abundance you, you do but all you need to do is to shine more shine more give more i know that you may be feeling tired but it feels like you really are like the sunshine to other people you are warming them up you are inspiring them you are supporting them you may be teaching them you're doing something for people your path is connected with people well all paths are connected with people this or the other way but it feels like you are there to warm people and now it's your time to shine so if you are kind of shying away from shining to from putting yourself out there from putting your creativity your job your talent out there stop stop doubting yourself just your abundance lies in accepting accepting your talents accepting who you are accepting that people are coming closer to you to get warmer to get something uh from you it doesn't like the sun is shining for everybody it doesn't make it less it doesn't make it drained it's just your nature and you need to accept it finally and it will help you to feel more grounded to feel more um to feel lighter on your way so your next step is stop stop doubting stop doubting really i think we've been having um, similar the road to abundance if you haven't seen this pick a card I, I posted last week please do it because uh, i feel like one of the policies for you the sun again you are just the sun stop stop doubting yeah you are a dreamer you have a lot of moon energy but your your nature is the sun but you are limiting this it's not somebody else you are limiting your sun your sh oh yeah yeah this is what i've been feeling you are afraid and the ten of wands so guys, your next step to happiness is to accept the responsibility that comes with the talent. Responsibility to to uh, to make this talent grow, to work on it, to show it, to shine for people. You are the sun, but you are just, oh no, I'm not that good, or maybe I, uh, uh, like, oh, it's too hard, or it's too much responsibility. You are avoiding the response you really need to put yourself out there and to accept that this is your nature it, it will not destroy you shining shining for people it will not destroy you it will only make you happier if you accept it within yourself your sunny nature your warmth your kindness your support your inspiration whatever it is for you it's not how to say uh this weight then you believe will come together with you putting yourself out there more it's is in your head it's 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 not real it's not real but you have everything in you to succeed and to become but it seems like um outpouring your talents of to the world onto people is is a part of your happiness when you accept the responsibility that comes with it you will be happier this is your next step stop stop stopping yourself okay i want a couple more oracle cards pile number one you are very strong yeah you're not stuck between two worlds you exist between two worlds you are a dreamer you only see the sun and the moon two in one 
You, okay, I'm getting so many goosebumps. You are the sun and the moon and you are kind of in between and you need to combine those things. Don't be afraid of your shadow sign side. Maybe you, you're afraid of it, uh, but our talents are in the shadow side. It's within our inner children and you need to be more flexible with it. It will make you happier when you accept your nature. It feels like there is a part of your nature you still do not accept or you're still afraid of it or you're avoiding it or it's like too difficult it's it's too much but you are the emperor the son the magician all together and you were born to to change something to change lives of, of people and it's not it's not going to be as difficult as you imagine it to be because it's kind of in your nature you were born this way you 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 don't really need to change yourself you just need to continue doing what you're doing and stop stop either stop avoiding praise because maybe people are praising you or maybe people coming to you teach me to do what you're doing or just teach me uh, give me guidance something people are coming to you for guidance people are coming to you for this uh, sunshine and you're like uh, 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 you're trying to weasel your way out of it but uh, it's not helping it's not working except accept your talents and your nature and you will be happier couple more cards against the grain in the world not of the world same as between worlds you are very special pile number one very special you're like between ethereal world and material world you are most most creative and talented people they are kind of living in two worlds at the same time and it means that you are there and it's difficult against the grain it's difficult it's difficult because uh movement forward demands a lot of effort from you but you need to start seeing the true you see yourself accept yourself this is about you accepting you and accepting the path that you've chosen for yourself before you came here, right? Chose to accept your destiny and it will be much more, you, you will become much happier. It will be lighter, it will be easier for you. Well, pile number one, I wish you a lot of strength and success on your path because it seems like, yeah, it can lead you somewhere uh, where you can lead people. Maybe you're leading them already, you're helping them already, you're shining for them already. So continue on this path and just stop avoiding yourself and it's gonna make you happier you are who you are well uh let me know uh, if the reading hits home uh, i hope the message finds whoever needs to hear it i uh, would love to read your comments i always read them and um if you enjoy this don't forget to hit that like button subscribe stay tuned for more and if you're in need of a private reading and you want to have one with me the information how to get it is down below in the description box and we're moving to pile number two now hey those who chose pile number two with this labradorite stone it has so many colors in it but i wish my camera would show them so pretty so let's see pile number two what's your next step Ooh, seven of wheels the devil seven of pentacles the devil six of wands the sun page of cups and the two of wands somebody's super stubborn right Pile number two it feels like you've been burning either with impatience or with some overwhelming desires uh, you feel me you may feel like you are not seen by other people you need more attention more um, for more people to see you somehow it's important for you to be seen and maybe you've been working and not getting results or something you see that other people are more successful than you are uh, your pile number two is also connected with success because you feel like either your effort it's not success per se it's like you you see that your efforts are being not seen by other people and you really really need to to heal this you really need to heal this you really need to let it go because this is keeping you stuck in some dark dark uh, moment okay let's see the sun is creeping in the sun is creeping in but we will have enough time to do the reading okay another page of cups you see 
the star, the tower, the page of cups, the nine of, and the, again, the seven of pentacles. You are kind of stuck. Uh, okay, it feels like you feel, you have a dream, you have a dream. But like whatever you do is not working out. It's not bringing you the results that you want. You, you're you doing, it's not working. You're doing it, it's not working. And you're just tired and you're like, you are feel you feel like maybe you need you should drop it but you shouldn't drop it you just need to focus on the next step like take it one baby step at a time one baby step at a time because you need to focus on the next step not on um, how long you've been doing it because you are stuck in the in the process like okay you're waking up in the morning I, I'm still not seeing, okay, and you feel low, and and the next morning the same, the same, the same. You you're kind of tired because you are stuck in the. I'm not there yet. I'm not there yet, and and it's every morning. It happens every morning. You really need to heal this, this attitude, this this energy. Because it feels like your your dream is fading away. For some of you, for some of you, the tower again, you had some dream. Mm. So you had some dream that is not working out, some idea that is not working out. You've been doing and doing and doing, it's not working, not working, not working, and um, you're stuck in the unsatisfied energy like this, but you have to wake up. You really have to uh, start seeing that there there is a new beginning. It feels like it's either a false fantasy, a false dream. It's not. It's something that is not yours. It's like you can never ha have what what's not yours. And maybe this is what life is showing you. There is something else. You are afraid to to free yourself from this dream which is not working you're afraid because you're afraid because you've you've invested so much in it that you think that the moment you step away like it will be a moment before success but it feels like you still you, you don't have any energy you spend all of your energy there and all of your energy is being uh, it's kind of eaten by by the process of not getting what you want and you're burning you're burning with the devil guys this this dream has become a toxic obsession and uh it has been eating your energy from the inside you're really really tired nine of wands nine of wands again you're tired and you really need to start seeing whether it's a true thing or not maybe there is some it feels like there is something else there for you something else but you already have your eyes on this another another thing but you feel like i can't drop it since i've been home like carrying it for so long i can't drop it now visions of life beyond death every journey starts with a single step this is what i've been like you really need to take it one step at a time and with the fool and with this mm, card here I feel like there is another path, another tunnel, another journey waiting for you out there. Another one which will be much, much lighter, much easier, much brighter than the one you are trying to uh, to walk on now. So there is something which is not working for you. It's not the true, not, not the true dream, not the true thing for you. Not your path. And it feels like if you let go, if you let go and trust the universe, because it feels like you're trying to swim against the current, but you need to trust the universe and the universe will take you to to your tribe, to your soulmates, to people who are the same and who will help you to kind of unlock your own path. Because right now you are swimming against the current and 
let the current take you where you are supposed to go. Uh, there are other people waiting for you there to help you to unlock your path. Well, this is your next step to happiness, guys. I hope it helps. Hope the message finds whoever needs to hear it. Let me know what you think about this the reading. I always read your comments and. Um, if you enjoyed the message, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, stay tuned for more, let me know in the comments what you think. And if you are in need of a private reading and you want to have one with me, the information how to get it is down below in the description box. And we are moving to pile number three now. Hey, those who chose pile number three with this Kaltzit stone, let's see, 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 see. Ooh. Hmm. So what is your next step to happiness? We have Ten of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, the Fool, the Hermit, Two of Pentacles, and the King of Wands. You need to step up, step, step up from those throne you're sitting in. Knight of Wands, then. Huh, just one, one moment. I want to clarify this Two of Pentacles. It feels like you, you've been, yeah, you have some responsibilities, you have some responsibilities, either it's a family or another kind of responsibilities, you've been taking not seriously enough, with the sign of wands and the fool, you've been either not paying enough attention to your family or to some responsibilities, I don't know, you've been avoiding them, ignoring them for some time. But it feels like you really, really need to step up your game and to take responsibility for your actions. Think it through and um, see what you've been avoiding. Because, again, responsibilities doesn't only bring weight to your shoulders, but it also gives you power. It, it speaks about power as well, because the emperor will have a lot of, he has a lot of responsibilities, but also he's got a lot of power. He's the most powerful man in his kingdom, right? So it seems like you have a kingdom, but you've been running around and not, mm -hmm, and not Mm, taking care mm, not taking care of your loyal subjects and there is somebody who is waiting for you there while you are you've been trying to just mm -hmm. you, it seems like you've so guys whatever I'm saying here I'm not I'm not judging you or anything I'm passing a message hopefully that it will um, help that it's gonna help so you've been avoiding investing into something important something that you need to see you've been yeah overindulging and leading sorry need to adjust lighting the sun is kind of changing everything you've been overindulging as living single life or being being a kid when you are needed as the king of pentacles when you're needed as the emperor when you're needed as as uh, a responsible adult and you feel like you don't see how it can make you happier, but it will. It will give you purpose and meaning to your life. But you've been choosing to avoid it. You've been choosing some meaningless fun and being immature. Well, there is something serious you need to... Okay. Another strength and the devil. Oh, the lovers. A major, major choice to make. Six of Cups. You either have kids or maybe younger siblings with the Empress or the kids. I don't know. You've been avoiding responsibility that you have. Either you, you've been not paying enough attention to your kids, to younger siblings, can be your nephews, something. Like, there are... Uh, There is somebody who is waiting for you to to step up step up your game take responsibility and actually it will make you feel better as well because for now well 
nobody's happy avoiding their life nobody's happy avoiding themselves and this is what you've been doing running away running away from yourself but no matter where you run you bring yourself with you you can't avoid that have the emperor the empress you so taking this responsibility is your next step to happiness this is your guidance a leg up you you really have to clean up you, the mess yeah i'm getting i wanted to say clean up your mind but uh they told me clean up your mess you have to clean up your mess and you have to uplift yourself and step up your game this is really important step up your game you know what i'm talking about you know you don't need to you know and um uh, you may feel like this is too much or you may feel like you've been in it too long or you got this responsibility too early but this is the right path for you and this path will help you to explore your potential to the fullest to ex to uh, to become who you are supposed to be Pandora's gift there is much more to this situation that you know and you really need to have faith in the process because you don't you're avoiding it you're running away you feel like mm, with this in the world not out of the world if you feel like if uh, you are maybe having fun or if you're absent or something nobody will notice but it mm, you notice it it's not about somebody else it's about you and your happiness and you will be much happier in like um, being responsible and having this responsibility than just having fun you feel like I don't know this responsibility is yeah it's, it's like it's not fair somehow it's not fair you feel like it's not fair but it is because you are the Empress or the Emperor already you have it in you you just need to I don't know we have a topic today a theme like people not accepting who they truly are and it's not making them happier it, it makes them less happy but to be happier you really need to see who you are and that you totally can do you are able to do this and if you and currently whatever you do and it's not healthy for you forget about everybody else it's not healthy for you and if you choose this responsibility is that you're avoiding you will grow you will get more mature you will get stronger you will get better you will get happier well guys let me know uh what this is about for you this is really interesting pile pile number three um but if you're saying it's not fair but it feels like again I do believe that we choose the life before we, we, we come here. We choose our path. We choose the destiny. And this is your chosen path. This is your destined path. This is what you can do. And you will be happier doing than avoiding. Well, again, I do hope the message finds whoever needs to hear it. Let me know what you think about it. And if you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, thank you for more. And if you're in need of a private reading, the information how to get it is down below in the description box. Have a great day and I hope to talk to you soon. Bye.